Hey there, welcome to this Power Automate tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the concat function to combine text strings in your flows. Whether you're working with dynamic content or just static text, concat is one of the most useful string functions in Power Automate. Let's get started. So what exactly is the concat function? The concat function is used to combine or join two or more text strings into one single string. You can use it with static text, dynamic content from triggers or actions, or a combination of both. The syntax is pretty straightforward. Here's a basic example. This will return the string hello world, joining the words with a space in between. Now, let's see how to implement this inside Power Automate. I have already created an instant cloud flow for this tutorial. First, let's create a new step and find the compose action. In the inputs field, we will enter our concat function. Inside the parenthesis, we need to add values, so let's add two single quotes and inside add a string of text. Let's add another string of text inside the quotes, which we will be concatenating to the first value, basically joining them. Click OK, then go up to the top right and click Test. Hit Save and Test. As you can see, the strings are now concatenated, but we have a problem. They don't have a space between them. If you think back to the example shown earlier, we need to implement two single quotes with a space in between. This will give us a space between our words. So let's go back to edit. Go back into the expression, and let's add the single quotes with a space followed by a comma. Click Update. OK, let's retest this. As you can see, there is now a space between our two strings. A more practical use case would be to use dynamic values passed as an input. In the flow, I have added two variables, first name and surname, so we want to concatenate these two values. To do this, we must go back to our expression. Let's remove the values out and replace them with our dynamic content. Click Dynamic Content and click the variables we have just made. You don't need to wrap them in single quotes as Power Automate already implements them for us. OK, let's save and test it. Really is that simple. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe.